Alright guys, we're back, and I had to skip a scene, because well, it will become repetitive. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm just gonna focus on asking the questions to Hiragi, and then go on from there, because yes, it seems that they do repeat everything that goes on, or maybe I should just skip until I get the confession, and then just get uh, all of Yusuke's route. <laughs> Yeah, that could come in handy instead of just, you know, skipping around. Well, anyways, guys, let's continue. <laughs> yes, break time. Yeah, so naturally my examine goes through the roof. Alright then, now should I go? We already know where we're going. It's usually use time. Oh! I spot Hiragi walking along. Sweet, I can go talk to her now. Hiragi. Yes, No, nothing particular. Okay, what should I talk about now? Okay, last time I did small talk, school life... Uh, uh, I know that if I don't talk to her directly, in, in the sense that... Yeah, if I make a mistake, she's just gonna <laughs> blow me off. <laughs> uh, I know she doesn't... If I do say this to her, she's just gonna blow me off. So... Let me go with this one. Let's, move, let's go with the statement instead of a uh, question. <laughs> Man, my body cries when I go out on weekends. Like paying for karaoke or first class train tickets. It's awful. <laughs> oh, yeah, I guess that's an option. I think that's a problem. Yep. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, dang it. Yeah. I know last time it actually went pretty well, and now it's not gonna do the same thing, right? Okay. You prefer red or white meat on your soup? <laughs> another, another one, right? Well, it's one of the things that's different for everyone in uh, every household. So I was wondering what your family did. <laughs> Come on, just tell me. I won't kill you. <laughs> what about combination, Miso? How could you? Miso must be red. Uh, yeah, let's go with this. <laughs> How could you? Miso must be red. Huh? <laughs> What's red miso troll? Here, I'll spell it out for you. First of all, red miso is healthier than white miso. It also spends more time ripening, maturing than white miso, so its flavor is far more prominent. Plus, it's saltier than white miso, which all it means you don't gotta use as much. It's money saving. <laughs> Surprise look. Oh man. It's an acquired taste once you have it uh, a few times, it's alright. Alright, good. Good advice. I'm giving her advice actually. Yeah, there goes the bell. I'm gonna skip class and go somewhere with me, okay. <laughs> Uh, well, that wasn't too bad, I guess. Perhaps. Perhaps. Another time skip? Perhaps. Yeah, let's go to the cafeteria. Uh, what's the occasion? Yep, this is the same as last time. Okay, I'll take some crispy fried chicken and a bottle of melon soda. Yep, same conversation. Alright, time skip. Once again, I know this is sad. Maybe you should just skip all the way to the getting the actual like side stories, like side scenes I should call it. Not side scenes, but like Oh, never mind, I'm confusing myself. <laughs> yeah, okay, thanks, Skip.
that was a bit fast. <laughs> okay. Yep. That was kind of short. Maybe I could have just played it. Uh, yep. I spot Hiragi walking along. Hiragi. Uh huh. Maybe something this time that actually makes sense. Yeah, that's a good question. But she's gonna tell me that it, it's none of your business. <laughs> Did you come to school late? Hiragi? Yeah, she does, I think. <laughs> Perfect. What kind of person do you think you are? I don't think this conversation is going to be anywhere. Yep. Is there another one? I mean, I mean, I can probably have new... new ones, right? I, I think the last small talk had something to do with, uh... The weather, right? Yeah. That's like the weakest question to ask. Let's see if there's something in school like things. Oh yeah, there are. Okay. Uh, don't you wish there were classes about having fun? Uh, do you ever get uh, those times where you like you get into studying? Teachers can really make a room in class. Yeah, there you go. That's a good statement, I guess. You know, teachers can really make a or ruin a class. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I'm getting advice from her. But then, what's the point of teachers? <laughs> I got my with her. Yeah, that was bad. That was bad. <laughs> oh man. Uh, I really need to skip over this. On the other side of the screen, there was some Jimmy How do you seem for it? Okay. Oh, that soy milk pudding looks so good. Wait, on the screen? There isn't any decent enemy on today, so I decided to just sleep. I want my Jizuki too. Warn me that staying up late isn't good for your skin. Mojizuki. Alright, good night. Oh, okay, finally, I get a... There's no... <laughs> There's no options here. Oh, don't tell me it's the... As someone yearns for the life of excitement, my will carry uh, me here for some reason other than the hope of chance counter. Maybe I'll find a cutie reading book on the bench and there's spot a beautiful girl on the balcony playing a sweet serenade uh, with her flute. My delusions are endless, but as sad as it may be, reality is not as lovely as my delusions. Ah, uh, damn man, what's a guy gotta do to find himself a girlfriend? I don't think I got this before. I'm just gonna play along. Uh, is that Hiragi? I spot Hiragi sneaking around in front of me like some escaped combat. What in the actual hell is she doing? Oh, wait. Yeah, I think I remember this one. It's weird to see her trying to hide her presence like that, considering how well bombastic her personality is. What you doing? <laughs> yeah, I don't think I got this before. <laughs> Eh, whatever. I'm gonna play along, okay? Is that so? I'll be careful next time. I'll do that next. I'll, I'll do that. Next time I'll see you, I'll make you, I'll make you know I'm there first. And I'll tiptoe up to you and whisper in your ear. <laughs> See, that's the point. It's better to be startled than creeped out. <laughs> I did basically greet her for what it's worth. If that startled her then, well, that's her fault. But I mean, if you had to choose one or the other, being startled in the is the preferred choice, huh? Choices are an important part of everyday life, Hiragi. You never know when God might hit you with that golden choice that can change your life forever. You're telling me... <laughs> You're telling me I'm making the wrong choices already. I went from actually having a good experience or a good... Yeah, I get making good choices in the last gameplay. Now it went down to the point that... Oh man, dating said. So much for trying to beat June 10th. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna make that in my 
uh, with beautiful humans like the ability of uh, ambition, such as grand choice. So we must approach every day as oh, that day will be the day uh, when we when the choices come. Hi, hi. Uh, she is quite evidently not amused. But hey, I don't mind. I'm basically just killing time here. Yeah. <laughs> By golden choice, the ultimate judgment. You must choose between either a bath full of boiling water or a bath full of mucus at room temperature. <laughs> what? Now, dear Hiragi, which would you choose? <laughs> yeah, I, I think I would have said the same thing. <laughs> One, you die, and well, the other one, I guess. I don't know. I dodge here. <laughs> Hiragi Sponge. Oh, we went from... Oh, this is different now. We went from... Himari Sponge. Now we're going for Hiragi's. The other ones don't hurt, and these ones... <laughs> they do, and we avoid them. Let's go. Ha ha ha, not really, Hiragi. Try again in 10 years. <laughs> She's seriously trying to kill me here. Okay, time out. That was a dumb question. I'll acknowledge that. I promise I'll take it seriously now. Yeah, perhaps. Uh, I wouldn't deny it. The holding choice, state two. You must eat one of the two. Hi, <laughs> hi. Oh no, man. What? That makes no sense. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> Sorry, but I can't I can save my brain on autopilot, it's still dodge your attack. And I doubt her punches would hurt even if he did that. Oh I think they would though, I think they would. <laughs> she never really puts force into her jab, so they kind of come off as curly, really. <laughs> Well, if you insist, hit me with your best shot, baby. Hey, that's a song reference. <laughs> I beckoned her towards me with my hand. Oh! Her, her right fist landed, I couldn't hit on my stomach. Oh <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> You'll have to try harder than that. <laughs> yes. I had a hunch of something like this one happened. I take something out from my undershirt. <laughs> you had a pillow or something? So I keep repaired with this. Or no, I borrow from the. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you destroyed it. Thank you, Genki. I shall remember this noble sacrifice of yours for the next five seconds. So yeah, I was really wondering what the heck you were doing. I saw you sneaking around all stealth-like. This is totally new, actually. <laughs> this is not like last time. <laughs> huh? Could it be? Are you stalking your crush? Messing around with Hiragi is pretty fun. Anyone else might regard her as mean-spirited and scary, but I just find her a bit childish and no fun at times. <laughs> Can't really think of any other reasons someone would be sneaking around like that after school. Huh? Hiragi being stalked? By who? Uh, nope. Yep, <laughs> <laughs> my this time she sends a kick flying towards me. Phew, that was close. Maybe she's better at kicking than punching. You might not want to raise your legs so high when you kick Hiragi. I could see your panties again. <laughs> <laughs> that was your mistake though. Her face light lights up bright red as she pulls down her skirt. <laughs> You send the kick. <laughs> Threw those into the river earlier. <laughs> 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 you 
Even though she's shouting and screaming, you still tell she's a girl at least by her reactions. For whatever reason, the smile she showed me in the park flashes through my mind. Hey, if you shout to Solal, they'll find you, Hiragi. <laughs> Hey, you'll get a good night's sleep tonight, not bad if you ask me. Hiragi never misses an opportunity to quip at my jokes. Yep, I definitely like uh, unlikely girls more than boring ones. Oh. Someone looking for you. <laughs> She immediately seeks out somewhere to hide. Hmm, what do we have here? Your screams are pretty funny, Hiragi. Okay, okay. She pulls me into the bushes with her. Now this is weird. Crap, is she actually being stalked? Who are you? <laughs> She's right here! Sorry, but I'm curious. Why are you hiding? She's clearly younger than you. Or is that little pipsqueak tormenting you? Not my business, but she was the one that got me in half involved. I got a right to be curious. Like she's searching really intently for Hiragi. It's kinda concerning. <laughs> And quite frankly, she doesn't seem intimidating at all. Uh, okay. Man, you're loud. <laughs> okay, so she's from the swimming club. Practice. Oh, is she a fellow swim team member? Yes, say yes. Good to know. Dang, you're skipping? Then how come you're hiding? Just go to practice. <laughs> Is that so? You can't. Unfortunately, I don't know. I didn't know I, <laughs> I know what just yet yeah, is. But I know that most clubs and athletic teams do get a lot of first years around this time of year. Oh, you got yourself a fan. That's good. Dang, that's incredible. You got yourself a fan now, huh? Perhaps. So she idolizes you. Let her be. I never had a similar experience, so I can only wonder what is it like to have someone who adores you like that. I imagine there's a lot of happiness in it, and a bit of embarrassment too, but for Hirai, it doesn't seem to be any of that. <laughs> You're blushing though. Uh, is that happiness I see in your face, dear Hirai? Boy, talk about an open book. She doesn't hate this. It's such a literally plain as day. But since she still admit, adamantly refuses to say as such, it must just be a conflict with her personality. Nothing wrong about that. The girl's cute as a button. And she really does respect you too. You really should just embrace it and uh, instead of running away. How many people can actually say their underclassmen respect them? Certainly not a lot. I'm just speaking personally here, but I think it's much better to be loved than hated. How so? What? How do you not understand that? The poor girl just wants to swing with her beloved role model. It depends on how you look at it. Yeah, sometimes when you're in the tournament, it becomes a team sport. I mean, it depends. <laughs> you know, uh, uh, I never knew that. Never thought I'd hear Hiragi say that. Okay, 
Uh, I think I understand. So, uh, like when you're doing karaoke and you don't want anyone bothering you when you're jamming out for your to your favorite tune. Is that so? Not even one scrap. She wants to be your friend. Man, you're popular. I suppose. True. For me, that'd be well. <laughs> oh, this guy. Uh, what are you planning? You do realize this is the exact reason you have no friends. I doubt it. Blimey. Uh, this is not something a young lass ought to be saying. I'll try. Okie okie. <laughs> With oki okiwagi. Just wanna be alone. I won't bother you. <laughs> hey, practice is starting soon. You better get going. <laughs> Maybe someday. The hollering begins. I don't mind the energy, but she's is she like this at home too? That's a bit graphic. Please don't do that. Aha, uh -huh, busted. You were too loud. <laughs> Wait up, Hiragi. What about this girl makes you so afraid? She's short and slender. Her limbs are nice and supple, and her skin is smooth and, and pale. And the smile on her face is just so bright I would believe you if you told me she was an angel. Hmm? What? Are you serious? <laughs> this girl is crazy, but yeah, I think first things first, I gotta calm her down. Hurtful? <laughs> wow. Oh, that's a knockout. Misumi Mako. I'm her boyfriend. <laughs> her eyes are sparkling. Mako chan looks so absolutely delighted. You think we were talking about her boyfriend? Haha, uh -huh, she's a good girl. <laughs> Don't say that, Mako chan. You'll be okay. Sadly for Kirai, the girl seems to be too much of an airhead to be scared away by her mean spirited comments. Wow, Mako Chan is strong. I'm not gonna be messing with Mako Chan. <laughs> I don't wanna be dragged. But honestly, if she felt that violated, 
she could have easily been broken away. Really? Hmm, mm, seems fun. And then uh, I think I'll go watch. I feel about, uh, a bit bad about this, but this is gonna be what I spend my afternoon doing. My peeking on the girls in the gym. Well, alright guys, we're gonna stop right here. Yes, we finally met a new character, Mako-chan, the girl that idolizes Hiragi. That's great, that's just great. I have a feeling that at the end of uh, Hiragi's route, uh, they're gonna become close friends. It's just obvious. That's good. That was good. So I guess next time we're gonna continue with, you know, the pool scenes once again, another pool time. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Well guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you made it this far into the video, leave a like, leave a comment if you would like to as well. And I'll see you guys on the next one.